Then let his destiny unfold. lucky. Like finding a four-leaf clover. <laughs> Although I think I prefer the clover. Oh, look, little sparrow. Castle Fairfax looks so nice in the snow. Imagine the grand dining hall. I bet Lord Lucien's having roast duck this time of year. But he must be really lonely since his wife and his little girl died. In that big castle, all by himself. If only we could live there. What is going on over there? Come with me, little brother. Hello, the young Rose. You look hungry. Have you reconsidered my offer? We'll never be that hungry. The answer is no. You'll be back, and I'll be waiting for you. Come on, little sparrow. Let's see what's going on. Oh, that filthy creep. I hate him. Oh, he's just a trader. I can't see anything past this lot. A ladies and a gentleman. I have travelled the land, accumulating wondrous and mysterious objects, which I now offer to you for the modest price of five gold. Best thing to do is Consider this. This is truly a magical mirror. For as long as you look into it, it will make you beautiful. I'll take it. Very wise. Now, just remember, the magic only works if you look at it in complete darkness. Ah, now this is truly a marvel. This small, unassuming box is actually a device created by the ancients, as used by the old kingdom rulers themselves. <laughs> Turn the handle three times, and you shall be granted a single wish. There's no such thing as magic. Has he got any of them magic toothpicks? We live in grim times indeed, if the young are too world-weary to believe in magic. Most children your age believe eagerly. Look, I can see your eyes are bad, but I'm telling you, that music box is rubbish. That's what the seller thinks. He has no idea what he stumbled upon. But you have an inkling, don't you? Some part of you wants to believe it's magic. What? You... You really think it could be? For five gold coins, you could have your answer. For five gold coins, we could eat for a week. 
Listen to me, Rose. At the end of that week, you and your little sparrow would be no closer to your dream. No closer to the inside of that beautiful castle. What if it is real? I bet we could get five gold pieces. And maybe this could be a way out of here after all. What is there to lose, little sparrow? Come on, there must be someone around here who'll pay us gold to... do something. Belinda! Oi, kids! Come here a minute! Hello, Derek. Lose something? My arrest warrants blew right out of my hands. It could be in all corners of Bowerstone by now, and I can't leave my post. Hey, why don't you find them for me? You could be like uh, little constables. Sounds... The warrants blew off in that direction. Through the alley by that bloke with a picture box. So, we look out for those warrants. But for now, let's your find friends them and relatives with a lifelike instant image. Has he stolen anyone's salt? Now, all you have to do is strike a pose for my little device. You'll be positively betwazzled by the results. Be what? Ah, yes, I've been improving my vocabularium with a wonderful book bought from Mergo the Treater. A thesaurus. He's a bit silly, isn't he? But this could be fun. What is that thing anyway? That poor man. Does he know how silly he looks? <laughs> Wondrous! This thing's going to be more popular than a pox. I just have to wait three months for picture to developify, and I can start showing it around. Oh, I can almost smell the gold. <laughs> three months, he says. Told you it was a swindle. Easy money for us. He's a bit scatty. Hope he's all right. We got our first gold Let coin, me though. Know if you find the warrants. This must be the alley Lawrence blew down. I should take a look. Rick's caught a dog and he's gonna kick the You like that, you stupid mutt? Hey, what the hell are you doing? Having a bit of fun. What's it to you? Oh! He hit a girl. Yeah, and now I'm gonna hit another one. Could have taken him though. <laughs> 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 